Lagos, the center of excellence, thank you very much, has a peculiar issue, which is traffic congestion. Now, since moving around the city is a must, are there alternatives? Oluwatoni Kolawali has this one. This is Lagos, the center of excellence in southwest Nigeria. There is one thing that is peculiar to this city, traffic. Many people dread living in Lagos because of the challenges associated with traffic congestion. Even medical experts say sitting in the car for several hours could cause serious health condition. So, is there an alternative? How can one avoid the many traffic gridlock? Let's find out. This is Ikorodu Ferry Terminal, one of the very few in Lagos. Many people patronize this ferry service because they needed to get to work on time and also avoid traffic. A little analysis of the traffic congestion will help you understand how serious Lagos traffic is and why it is necessary to use an alternative such as the waterways. Due to the daily traffic situation, going by the regular yellow buses or the government-owned buses from Ikorodu to Victoria Island is about two to three hours on a working day. But if there is a crisis, and you cannot rule out this possibility. It may take up to four hours. Now, this is the peculiar problem routing that axis. The Kurudu road that eventually links up with the island is only one road that conveys traffic to the mainland and the island, and it passes through the bottleneck at my 12 and the Todd Milan Bridge. But using the waterways to commute island or lake by ferry from Ikorodu is a maximum of 30 minutes. Yes, you are dried 30 minutes with no traffic. Mr. Jala is a regular face at the terminal. He say this ferry service is a lifesaver. You can compare the time it will take to, from Ikorodu by bus to compare to what is you have here. Because from here to VI, I mean, maximum, you spend 30 minutes. And if you are going by a taxi, you can spend less than one and a half hour to two hours. However, the issue of safety may be a major consideration. How safe is the water transportation? Perspective spoke with a marine engineer. And most of these jackets, you need to check them every six months to make sure they are good, so that when there is an accident, it will save your life. During this period, you, are in a, you know the visibility is not all that good. So they have to see where they are going and know the, that they are on the, the right track. I mean, if the, the government can do that, it will, be, it will help a lot. Although not all areas are connected to ferry service, but as part of the opinion that if the government opens up other alternatives like rail and water transportation, it may go a long way in easing up the volume of vehicles on the road, thereby reducing congestion across the state. I'm on my way to the island where my office is located. And for me to beat the traffic and manage stress, boarding this boat is the best thing for me. And for those of you taking the buses, let's meet on the island. Oluwato in Kolaole, reporting for Perspective, Lagos. Okay, so the boat ride does it, TK, right? Uh, but the helmsmen or women, as the case may be, must be well trained to ensure that cases of boats capsizing are largely reduced or erased. Ask my colleague Victor. He once had a narrow escape. 